morning, everyone. Welcome to Tarot Readings by Roxby. I am going to do your daily messages for today, Thursday, August 17th. Those of you that are new to the channel, welcome. Thank you guys so much for taking the time to subscribe. Okay, so I'm using Oracle of the Mermaids this morning, Los Arbeto. And we do have the High Priestess. So the High Priestess could be um, highly intuitive today. It's also a card, you know, sometimes, you know, needing to go within, you know, spend some quiet time, you know, to get a clearer understanding of ourselves and our desires. The High Priestess also represents, you know, someone who's very, you know, a, a mysterious woman, just not revealing everything, you know, all at once. You know, it could be a card of secrets, you know, you being secretive, um, maybe someone else being secretive. Could have something to do with being secretive regarding like moving on from someone or something. We're definitely moving on from something here or someone. Dolphins and the mermaids. It's time to let go of the old and worn out so that the new could come in. So with this card, you know, it's really alerting you to the fact that, you know, you need to make room for for the new. And, you know, by simply just, you know, not simply, but, but by letting go of the old, you know, first let go emotionally intellectually in other words like just you need to just say goodbye in your heart in your mind and once you do that you know the physical the physical letting go will just happen naturally in a peaceful way you're definitely moving there's definitely confusion probably around all this I personally, I have a feeling, not that I have anything here to support this, but I do have a feeling that some of you are dealing with a three-party situation. We do have eternal love here. Um, these are Archangel Michael. So with this card, someone is definitely sending you loving thoughts. They're definitely sending you love right at this moment. And the first person that comes to your mind is the one that's holding these loving thoughts about you. you know, maybe you've been worried about a relationship and, you know, this symbolizes, you know, Archangel is, you know, reassurance that, you know, all is well, the angels, God, the universe, your spirit guides, whatever it is for you, you know, are watching over you, you know, helping you with your relationships. Some of you could be moving on to a soulmate relationship. For some of you, an ex-lover could come back into your life with this card. That's probably the situ this situation here. And you're taking action. You're moving on. You're taking action. I just feel like whatever happened here... It will cause you to take action and definitely move on. And you're probably being secretive about it, but you're taking action. Um, Angel answers. So, you know, the time has come with this card to take action. You know, do away with the procrastination, the uncertainty. You know, in your heart, you do know that this is what you want to do, that this is what's right for you. Whether you're focused on a career or a relationship, whatever the topic is, you know, the fulfillment of your wishes, it's not going to just fall in your lap. You have to you know, actively you know, be focused on the pursuit of what you want. And it feels like that's what some of you are doing. That's awesome. Okay. Um, 
For your relationships, I'm using Psychic Tarot with a Heart, John Holland. Oh, there's definitely there's definitely three three party situation. I was right about this. I had a feeling. Okay, seek the truth. Um, sorry, uh, Psychic Tarot with a Heart, John Holland. So, again, you know, both of these cards speak about listening to your intuition. Your intuition, it's a, it is, it's a powerful ally. You know, and today is obviously a good time to trust your intuition. Oh, someone from your past is returning. Okay, now it makes sense. Okay. Follow and trust your though that inner promptings. Absolutely, I could totally see here that all is not as it seems in some of your relationships. Use your psychic senses to determine which of these people may be questionable. You know, trust in what your intuition is saying right now. You know, with both of these cards. Like, really, really listen to your intuition. And it feels like a lot of you are. You're taking action. You're moving forward. You know, as much as you would like to trust these people or this person, it really is important for you today to question their motives. Be cautious about sharing your most private thoughts and feelings. Um... And I think that's what you're doing. You know, you're being secretive, you know, in order to avoid allowing yourself, you know, to be placed in a vulnerable position. You know, be cautious of one sided relationships with the other person. You know, they're probably not participating fully. Or is avoiding obligations and responsibilities. And now really is the, the perfect opportunity. You know, for those of you that are married, you know, to really get to the bottom of this behavior. You know, be sure that your role in your relationship is above board and, and you know, completely based on honesty. But then, you know, that's for those of you that are married. For those of you... I think someone from your past came back. Reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. You know, you're probably either married or in a relationship. It definitely caused this three-party situation. And you're being secretive about it. Not revealing everything and moving forward. I will say this, though. With the High Priestess, this absolutely really could be a soulmate relationship that you're moving toward, right? And the High Priestess for me is a very, very, very spiritual woman. And I do feel like this could be a relationship where you both feel... How do I want to say this? You both feel deeply, like intuitively connected. You know, for a man, you know, it definitely represents finding that perfect woman that all men want, you know, mysterious, secretive, but yet very, um, incredibly exciting. You know, with the high priestess emotionally, you know, it does show that you are attuned to your heart, emotions, 
you know, and dreams and your feelings, you know, have, have an unconscious motivation, like you really definitely could be moving to a soulmate relationship. Definitely. You're definitely taking action on that today. If not you, it could be, you know, the person that you're dealing with, involved with. But if this is absolutely a three-party situation. For some of you. That absolutely could be a soulmate one. Beautiful. All right, guys. Thank you so much for taking the time to view the video. I hope it helps you guys out for the day. Love you guys. Have a beautiful day. And I will see you back here soon with the weekend love scope. I'm going to get that up very soon here. All right, guys. Have a great day. See you soon. Bye-bye.